now that you have selected uh, the uh, paragraphs that you feel you would be likely to use in your paper, we need to finish the job. And uh, if you remember correctly, we need now to uh, tie our arguments, which are here, or excuse me, our facts, which are here in the red, to our argument, which is here in the topic sentence. So, uh, as I indicated earlier, that these uh, the, these comments don't immediately show harm. So it is up to me to show a connection between uh, uh, these flawed arguments and some sort of harm. So I'm going to type at least two sentences to indicate that. And I've already done that, and here they are. Um, and what I'm saying here is that relying on flawed information can lead to bad decisions, both the personal and governmental level. Since the misinformation in the anti-subsidy arguments deals with personal finance, ecology, and natural e and national economic policy, relying on this information can lead to decisions harmful to both consumers and the country, period. And so that is my commentary. And then my concluding sentence is, damaging our economy, our planet, and ourselves show how these arguments uh, are harmful. Uh, and so uh, that is finished, except for our coloring here, which needs to be green. The, um, uh, uh, the commentary needs to be green. And so now I have finished this step. Um, I, I'm going to want to take out the highlight as well, so we'll click highlight none, and uh, that's done. And so we have now all of the elements of a good paragraph here, and we will work next in RP7 on uh, settling that down and writing a good, uh, consistent paragraph. Uh, that is it for RP6. Thank you.